our arms there. Then you're better off not understanding. That may be true, James, but we need to understand every sliver of this show stat. Here's what we know about his dark materials so far. Based on Philip Pullman's best-selling epic fantasy trilogy, his Dark Materials is set in a multiverse with some similarities to our own and some obvious differences, like demon animal companions who are manifestations of a human's inner self. If this sounds familiar, it's because it is. The first novel in Pullman's trilogy was the source material for the 2007 film The Golden Compass. After a lukewarm response from audiences and critics, New Line Cinema pulled the plug on their plans for a movie trilogy. But this would eventually pave the way for the television adaptation, which Pullman believes will serve the fantasy novel series better. BBC One was inclined to agree, as they commissioned an eight-part adaptation back in November of 2015. The series took some time to materialize, but once it did, it found a second home with HBO, who purchased worldwide distribution rights outside of the UK in March 2019. The plot centers around orphan 12-year-old Lyra Bellacqua, who is being played by Daphne Keene, best known for her breakout role in Logan. In the story's parallel universe, Lyra's up against a group of child abductors known as the Gobblers, but will get some help from her uncle, Lord Asriel. Played by Daniel Craig in The Golden Compass, BBC One turned to split star James McAvoy to take on the adventurous role in this adaptation. I've never felt uh, like this before. Caring for the orphan Lyra is the manipulative Marissa Coulter, who's being played by the affair's Ruth Wilson. The smaller role of Lee Scoresby, a balloonist in the novels, went to Hamilton megastar Lin-Manuel Miranda. Die-hard HBO fans have to love that The Wire's Clark Peters is back on the network to play Dr. Karn. Yeah, I've had my moments. The series was adapted by Jack Thorne, who adapted the New York Times bestseller Wonder and has a slew of other television credits to his name. Tom Hooper, who won an Oscar for The King's Speech, directed the first two episodes of the season. Sitting in the director's chair for two other episodes is Otto Bathurst, known for 2018's Robin Hood and the very first episode of Black Mirror. Who could forget the pig? BBC One was originally hoping to get the series on the air in 2017, but fate had its way, and the series will air later in 2019. Pushing the release date may be a bad sign for some productions, but not here. A second season of the show, which is one of the most expensive British dramas ever made, has already been greenlit. Now is the time to choose a side. 